Are you struggling to find unique music for your videos? Most editors search for hours on end to find the right music only to end up getting a copyright strike after using it. Now you can create royalty free music that fits just about any type of video using the AI music generator in PowerDirector 365. Let's jump right into the music business, shall we? The AI music generator can be found under the audio tab and music generator. The interface opens up in all of its wonderful glory and I'm gonna break it down to you. We'll start with the top left section. Here you can select your genre, which is the style of music, your mood, which is the feeling or emotion you want your music to convey to your viewer, and the theme, which is the type of video your music will be in. For genre, we'll go ahead and select hip hop. For some strange reason, I think some of y'all knew I was gonna select hip hop. For the mood, we'll select epic. And for the theme, we're gonna go with cinematic. Now we'll head down to the bottom left section. Here you can select your tempo, which is the speed of the music, your intensity, which increases the layers of complexity in the music, the length, which is the duration of the music, no more than cinco minutos, por favor. And finally, the number of songs you wanna generate. Now, I recommend making at least three songs so you have some variety to choose from when it's done. So for tempo, we're gonna leave that normal. And just in case you want to find out more, you can hover over this info button and left click it and it'll tell you the different tempos, the beats per minute for each tempo. And for intensity, we're going to change that to intense. If you click on the intensity info button here, it gives you more information about the intensity for quiet, mid, intense, and extreme. And then for the length, we're going to make this around 30 seconds. And for generate songs, we're going to select three. And you can see here that it says it's going to use nine credits to do this. So three songs, three credits per song, nine credits. So I'm going to click on generate. We've got a conflict people. We've got a conflict. As you can see, there's a style conflict. It says the style and or tempo that you choose or chose are in conflict. They do not work well together. It says that CyberLink Power Director is going to remove or adjust the conflicting style slash tempo. So you can review the updated parameters and then click the generate button again. Do you wish to continue? And then under that, it tells you the mood, the epic mood doesn't fit. So if I left click on yes, it's going to remove that. So no longer do you see epic here. Now I can leave it like this or I can try to add a different mood. So I'm gonna left click on mood and I'm gonna click heavy and ponderous. I don't know what the hell ponderous is, but I like how it sounds, ponderous. So I'm gonna left click on ponderous and I'm gonna click on generate again. Now that it's done, you get to see if you like what you made. And if you like what I made, why not click on the like button? Subscribe to Power Director University and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my tutorials and live streams. All right, now that we're done, we're presented with previews of our music. You can listen to it by clicking on play. If you want to change the intensity, you can do that by clicking on the intensity here, changing it to a different one. So let's say I change it to extreme. Well, now it says regenerate. Three credits, okay? Bro ham like me don't feel like spending no more credits, so uh, I'm not gonna do that thing. I'm gonna go ahead and click back on intensity and change it back to intense, and that regenerate uh, then grays out, which means that I don't need to spend any more credits. Okay, I'm good to go. Now you can see where the music is located on your PC if you wanna use it in other programs by clicking on the folder icon here. And it opens up the folder where the music is. You can take it from here, use it wherever you want to. Yada, yada, yada. You know the routine. I'll go ahead and close out the file explorer. But we want to use this music in our own video that we're working on right now. So in order to do that, you can click on this blue plus sign and it will add it to the music library. And it tells you that it's going to add it and tells you where it's going to add it. So you click on OK. 
And now we can close out the AI music generator. And if you go to audio and you go to AI generated and you left click on AI generated music, it will show the music that you created and you can hold on your left mouse button over the music and drag it down to the timeline track that you want it to be on. And you can play it and listen to it. Now, if you want to change the duration of the music for future videos, check out this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe for more Power Director love. See you next time.